And I've been waiting for this for a long time. You've yeah. been on the podcast twice Over already. the internet. Over the internet. Yeah. We've DM'd back and forth. I watched all your great runs in the, in the new was the Hellcat. Yeah. In Mexico, obviously. Those were cool. Don't speed in Canadian <laughs> roads. Yeah. Mexico only. I've been following your come up. You've been doing some great things. Cool, man. You're making big money. Yeah. What are the numbers right now? Um, I wouldn't call it big, but we did uh, four million in sales in our second year business. See, that, that's crazy, man. So. There's a lot we're gonna learn from this guy. Yeah. So let's take me back. Tell people who you are. Yeah, so I'm the president for Grant Cardone Canada. I also own another company called Yesa, which is Young Entrepreneurs Sales Academy. And we're a business that we, we basically either train your salespeople, that's what we do with Grant Cardone, or we are your salespeople with Yesa. Mm -hmm. So we'll meet with companies, we're in an office right now, and you know our sales business represents other companies. So a company wants a group of salespeople, they hire us, we figure out what their targets are, we figure out what their brand is, we find out what's their message they want to convey to their clients, and then we build a sales wow. team to achieve those results. So that's what I do. But more importantly, it's not really about what we sell, yep. it's about what we do with the salespeople. It's about yes. educating them, we take these young guys, yeah. we, we fill the sales positions with 18 to 35 year olds usually, yeah. Yeah. and then we give them an education at the same time. Yeah. So I just sat through one of those sales meetings, and the culture you guys have here is incredible. Yeah, like you, you could like probably it? you could take the most unmotivated guy off that street behind us, pluck him in here, and that guy's gonna come out cheering. Like, yeah, how, do, how do you build that? I how appreciate that, that. You know, that's um, building culture into the business is everything. So um, it really it really starts from the vision of the company and constantly hitting that on with your people all the time. I mean, Puya knows it. Uh, we're always talking about what's the vision of the business. So you start with a vision and values. If you have the vision and the values down, so vision is where are we going? Like, yeah. what are we looking to achieve? What is everybody's role in the journey? Mm. And then uh, what are the values of the business? What are we prepared to do? What are we not prepared to do yeah. from an ethics standpoint? Yeah. If you have the ethics of the business in, the values, you're constantly communicating on it and remind everybody of the vision, the culture is strong. When you lose sight of the vision and it just becomes about selling, things fall apart. And you have a great leadership team. Yeah, and you have and a great leadership team. Yeah. Great I mean, I think that was a big part of it. You have great it's leaders standing up in front of the room. It's not just you sitting up here doing everything. You found people and placed them in these roles yeah. and nurtured them to be what they are. Well, I mean, you find good people already. Well, I, mean, I mean, you can't build a Puya. So I got Puya over uh, here. Uh, you can't build a Puya or build a Daniel. Yeah. But what you can do is create an environment where they want to stay, where they're attracted to come in, and then you can give them mentorship and guidance if you're ahead of them on the journey. So. Definitely got to give kudos to my team. We picked a good team. I think I'm good at recruiting. Yeah. I think I'm good at attracting talent. Yeah. Uh, that's what I use my social media for. That's what I'm doing stuff like this for, yeah. is to find good talent. Yeah. And then, yeah, creating an environment of high performance and, and good values. Because guys like Puya and Daniel, they don't want to stick around an environment Agreed. that's not positive and that's not...